Hello and welcome back to my channel. My name is Maida and you're watching Maida Pores. Um, thank you so much for joining me today. If it is your first time here, well, welcome. And if you're a returning viewer, well, thanks so much for coming back and coming back to see me again. Really appreciate it. So for today's pour, I'm going to be reusing this canvas, this experimental canvas where I tried a few different techniques all on one thing here. Um, and I have, I'm going to be doing another Dutch pour blowout, um, kind of similar to the one that I did yesterday. Well, uh, I don't know when it was uploaded, maybe like a week ago. I don't know. Um, the last kind of starburst Dutch pour I did. Um, but this time I'm going to actually be a little bit more intentional with the flower look. Um, and I'm kind of hoping to, um, kind of make a big giant flower. <laughs> that's, that's the plan. Um, which I think my other one kind of looks like a big giant flower. So hopefully I can recreate that. Um, I have this as my base color here which is something that I mixed up myself. This is majoritively Artist Law Flow Acrylic White, but I did use some light blue Liquitex. Um, and I think the very last bit of my manganese blue. Um, and it's just, it's very thinly mixed because it's gonna be a Dutch pour, but it's just a really kind of light um, baby blue color, very light sky blue color, I don't know. Um, and then I have a whole bunch of other colors, which I will tell you what they are as I pour them on the canvas. But for now, I'm going to just get started by flooding my canvas with my blue. And I'm going to go ahead and speed this part up. So enjoy. Goodness, yes, 
This is pretty much what I was hoping for. <laughs> Has, have I ever actually had it turn out exactly as I hoped? So very rarely. This is one of those moments, one of those moments. The only thing I kind of want that to just be but I don't know. I don't want to mess with it. I don't want to mess with it. I'm just debating if I blow that out a little bit. But you know what? I'm not, I'm not going to mess with it. I'm going to leave it alone because I just think it's gorgeous as it is. I want it to dry exactly like this. I know it won't, <laughs> but I don't want to mess with it. <clears throat> I'm leaving it alone. I wanted to blow it out and have it kind of look like a big old flower. And I mean, obviously, uh, I mean, it reminds me of a Gerber daisy, which is one of my favorite, most favorite, favorite flowers in the world. And those come in a lot of really fun colors. This kind of incorporates all the fun colors <laughs> that a Gerber daisy may come in. But oh my golly gosh, oh my gosh. Okay, I'm going to bring you guys in for a close-up. The things, oh, that are happening, I don't know if you can see it properly from up there. So I'm going to go ahead and bring you guys in for a close-up to show you how pretty this is down here. And uh, thank you so much for watching. <laughs> I really appreciate it. I am thrilled. Oh, exactly what I was, exactly what I was imagining, exactly what I kept being like, I want, you know, I want to just see what, it, you know, if I intentionally do that, how it'll turn out. So, oh, it's so pretty. It's just so pretty. I just love it. Okay, so thank you so much for watching. Uh, if you enjoyed watching this video, please do hit that like button. Um, if you enjoy watching acrylic paint pouring videos, please consider subscribing because that is what we do here. A bunch of acrylic paint pouring videos. Um, again, thank you so much for watching and I will see you guys next time. Bye-bye. Okay. Let me show you what is happening in here. Okay. Because I feel like... It's just not doing it justice unless you get like really can see. I mean, so many beautiful cells, beautiful interactions. What this aquamarine is doing inside of here with the iridescent pearl is just gorgeous. And just, I mean, everywhere, everywhere is just such cool. I mean, look in here, so cool, so pretty. So I'm glad I decided to put some pink in here. I don't always use pink, but it was, I felt it needed some. <laughs> these cells in the center coming out, these white ones and the pink um, cells and also kind of lacing up in there. Just all of it. I'm here for all of it. I'm so excited. And it's really nice on this pale blue background. It's hard to see the color truly, I think, but but yeah, it's nice. So there you go. Thank you so much for watching. I will see you all the next time. Bye-bye.